What's up, y'all? I've been having a couple issues with my truck for the past few weeks now. I've been having a minor sputtering and misfires here and there. After doing a couple code diagnostics, I found a code 22, meaning that there's low signal from the throttle position sensor to the ECU itself. I was kind of ignoring it for a couple weeks because I recently replaced that part, but I didn't get it original. So I figured it was that part that had to had to be the issue. Um, a couple days after, uh, I kind of ignored it. Uh, my check engine light would start flashing. And upon that, I just, I figured I had to figure out the problem immediately. So here I am, I uh, have a new throttle position sensor to put in. The throttle position sensor is this one right here. This little, tiny little sensor right here with the gray on it, as you can see right here. I already uh, took the time to replace and remove all the parts connected to the air filter. Here's uh, your fuel injector. Here's the throttle position sensor right here. So this little connector. Just gotta disconnect that real quick. And then with your little, uh, with your T-tools, has just two little screws on there. I'm gonna go ahead and remove the screws now. It's a little tedious to do this with one hand. Pretty good results. Got both screws loose now. Try to slowly take the screw off by hand. Make sure not to lose the washers around the screw as well. Upon removing the screws, the throttle position sensor will just literally pop out. On its own. Looks like a pretty fresh piece. It's uh, manufactured by Santec. Figured it would be a better option than their last. It's uh, literally, I have this piece in the warranty. Swap it out for a fresh one. Upon installing, you must insert it. A bit offset from the actual screws you see the screw hole there a bit offset to the right and then uh adjust adjust moving to the left like this here and uh there is no spec in the manual for the calibration on it so i believe it's just to set it where the screws are so i'm going to try my best to align it now it's sitting now still slowly screwing it in by hand just to make sure it's sitting properly there you have it a little bit of movement now minor movement And for the screws, I'm only tightening it until it's snug. They weren't too tight upon removal. It should be set there. Make sure to have your connector back in. Pop in place, ready to go. Now when reconnecting, don't forget about your vacuum lines. Sensor. And if, as I was saying, don't forget about your map sensor. Your on the back. Test 